Tree and this is Stitchless TV. Now today I thought we'd have a go at filming outside. I feel very, very self-conscious because it's my little park. Now the main reason why we're filming today is because I want to tell you what I've been up to. Not only have I made this, look, very gorgeous and glittery coat, but I've been involved with a very special charity online auction, which you might be a bit interested in. Now this is much harder than I thought it was going to be. Anyway, I want to show you my coat. So that coat was made using fabric that I got specially printed. It's sequin fabric. And I had it printed at Fashion Formula with my own design on it. So the reason why I made this coat was to wear, you'll never guess where, to the BAFTAs. Can you believe it? Now we are, I don't know where to look. We are actually in a really nice part of London. So I thought I'd tell you about it as we walk around and you can have a look. So apart from the barking dog, can you see the river? Look at the river in the distance. How nice is that? So last Friday, I was lucky enough to go, like I said, to the BAFTAs. And the reason why I went there is because I've been helping out this charity called the David Adams Leukemia Appeal Fund. So about 25 of these amazing um, teddy bears that have been endorsed by all these famous celebrity actors, writers and singers. And they, they sign a little tag uh, with their autograph and then sewers and costume designers from all over Britain have made the most amazing costumes. In fact, I've got a story to tell you that relates to the sewing community and these bears. The people that run the charity, they were looking for someone to make the last four or five bears. And they contacted me to see if I wanted to do one or if I knew of anybody. So I put the word out on Instagram. So the response was completely amazing. So I don't know how well you can see me, but we are actually by the river now, which I know has absolutely nothing to do with gorgeous, look, gorgeous, glittery coats or handmade costumes for celebrity, whoops, teddy bears. But it's quite nice down here. Moving on, teddy bears. Maybe we should start with David Attenborough. It's actually the river in Richmond, if you're wondering. Can I see the bridge? Can you see the bridge? Now, I'm not going to talk about all of them, but I definitely are talking about the ones that were made with people in the sewing community. Let's have a look at the Ben Hardy bear as his character in X-Men, made by Jamie. So amazing. Look at those wings. Every single part of this bear was handmade, even down to his little boots. Yes, sorry, sorry about the bag. I'm still trying to get you a, a good shot of my coat because I don't really think you can see it properly. But the other bear that was um, totally brilliant was Vince Cable, as in Vince Cable, Liberal Democrat leader. He is the leader, isn't he? <laughs> Look at this, he's got trousers, shirt, tie, coat, and even a knitted scarf. Oh, and little shoes, he's got everything, Vince Cable. Oh, and hat, hat, of course he has a hat. Now another favorite of mine, they're all favorites, um, was the Bertie Carvel one. So Bertie Carvel, if you don't know, was Miss Trunchbull in Matilda. So I'm going to show you this. We've got hair, undergarments, underwear in fact, and hand-knitted socks. Did I say coat? Oh yeah. 
like a taffeta version of his waxed brown coat. Or do I say she? He, she. Definitely has that trunch ball look. Now, before I talk about the very last teddy bear, <laughs> all made from people on Instagram. So as on Instagram, I've got to show you this Sam Warburton bear made by Teddy and me. Um, he's a Welsh rugby player, if you don't know about rugby, but look at this. Everything, everything is handmade. Even those rugby boots with poppers as studs. Jamie Lawson Bear. Jamie Lawson is a singer. And Jamie Lawson Bear was made by Ingrid, who's this couture maker on Instagram. And Jamie Lawson, Jamie Lawson, <laughs> he also has a handmade wooden guitar made by, can't remember the name, I'll put it at the bottom, but it's definitely Dilworth. Is it John Dilworth? I think so. John Dilworth. So he makes violins usually, and he has made this handmade guitar for Jamie. Also, headphones. Look at those headphones. Leather headphones that pop on and off because they've got little detachable poppers. Gorgeous shirt. Fantastic jeans. Amazing job. You can have one last look at my digitally printed sequin sculptural bucket coat. Now, you all know about that. You can buy the pattern from So Different. Go and watch the video. And I hope you've enjoyed looking around. Where are we? Richmond. <laughs> and I'll see you again very soon, but very important. Go to the link in the description below. If you want to bid for any of those bears, they'll be quite expensive, but they're Stife bears and Charlie bears. So worth it. See you again very soon. Bye.